Hey guys, welcome to the Quick Term Girl Show. Gia here. Let's start with my stats. Today is VLCD day number four. And I woke up this morning and I weighed myself. And I am happy to report that I am 190.8 as of uh, this morning. So that gave me a loss of 1.2 pounds overnight. Yay, again. It's pretty awesome. I've been feeling great. Uh, my energy level is amazing how your energy level just shifts to the positive side while on this diet. Um, day four, it was a piece of cake today. It really was. Um, I, I have no complaints at all about today. I managed my hunger when I felt it coming on. You know, I took my HCG drops and you know, I waited 20 minutes and I had water and, you know, my snack or, or my lunch, which, by the way, I had my jerk chicken salad. It's squeezite. So try it. I put the, the recipe on my blog, which is right here. So uh, you guys should try it out. And um, I, I would have to say that since we are allowed to to have spices because they don't have calories well some of them don't have calories there are there are calories in spices if if um you didn't know there are um calories in there and i'll try to put the link to this very informative um blog i found that lists the calories in certain spices and seasonings so if you if you're thinking that there are no calories don't think that because there are and some of them even contain oil so you got to be really careful with that um however it it's really amazing to me how i went from being so hungry on day three uh, sorry on day two to not feeling any type of hunger on day four at all and it's it's just incredible the shift that my body is taking and my mind is taking and and it's it's just it, I'm loving this journey I really am I, I you know I, I I do have my moments I, I will admit I do have my moments where I think I'm detoxing from all all the bad stuff that I put in my body before but I would sit at my desk at work and all of a sudden I'll get a whiff of like Twizzlers or ice cream or icing from a cake or ch chocolate cake or you know I'll just get a whiff of it and it's nowhere around and I'm thinking it's it's leaving my system maybe from my loading days and all the other times I had all those things because I'm a Twizzler girl I love me some Twizzlers Unfortunately, I can't have any because I read the pack and one serving of Twizzles has 240 calories. <sighs> I even contemplated on licking a Twizzler. Just licking it. You know, accidentally falling onto it and having it fall into my mouth. But I didn't. I didn't. I'm having willpower and I cannot wait for P3. I really cannot wait for P3 because I'm craving, well, not craving, but I'm missing whole wheat bread and I'm missing cheese. <sighs> but I'm having fun with these recipes that I'm coming up with and I'm having fun with the limited ingredients that we have on P2. And I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit here and say it's not boring. It is boring, but you have to be really creative when you make your dinners and your lunch and your lunches. Um, just just think outside the box and think about it whatever you do with a big piece of chicken you can do with a little piece of chicken and you know you just have to eliminate the frying and and all that stuff but i know a lot of people use the coconut oil in phase two i'm not going to use the oil i'm not going to use oil at all um i grew up on coconut oil so i'm i'm i, I could attest to it, its great positive um, contribution to the diet. However, I'm choosing not to use any type of oil and find other ways to uh, saute or pan roast or pan fry or anything like that. I'm not gonna. 
I'm not going to use the coconut oil, but I'm probably going to use it in P3 for when I have to uh, bring all the other food groups and all the other types of food back into my life. But outside of that, everything's great. I feel great. My body feels great. My body looks great. I, I was sitting at work and I can kind of see like my toes now and it's... <laughs> It's amazing. It's amazing. I cannot believe it. And I keep saying, oh, well, you know, if I look down one day and I can literally see my belly button again, that will be awesome. So, you know, I, I'm just really proud of myself. And I'm proud of everyone out there that's trying it. I had one subscriber today say that they didn't know if they were going to continue. I think you should continue. You know who you are. I think you should continue. It's willpower. You gotta have willpower. The first few days are crazy, but think about the long run. Think about the, the effects it's gonna have on you on, in, the, in the long haul. Just just think about it and use other videos as inspirations. Uh, you know, I sit and I look at people's before and after and it's amazing to see them shrink. And if they can do it, you can do it. So don't give up, don't give up. You know, um, even if you lose 10 pounds, it's something you lost 10 pounds so, and those are 10 pounds that you never thought you can get rid of so don't give up but keep trying keep keep going you know and use use us use use the other uh dieters as a support system use us send us messages you know um and leave comments we'll get back to you you know and and just form 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 alliances or form form friendships on here because they're, they're amazing people out here doing this thing and they're rocking it they're and by the way saying rocking i read i think it's um uh, what is it uh cutting candy lips maybe i think that's her name um her definition of rock star i'm a rock star i think i'm a rock star so i want to be in the group rock star people <laughs> so I think I want to be a rock star I think I am I think I know I am I know I am I'm a rock star what what <laughs> so um that's pretty cool but there there are some people out here and you just got to utilize um, your resources with them and they're they're incredible so don't give up anyone out there you know having a hard time do not give up it's worth it you fall off the wagon, you get right back on. You fall again, you get right back on. Do not give up. And, you know, just remember, it's willpower, and keep your hand on the apple, because it will save your life. Uh, on that note, I am going to make myself a strawberry slushy. I cubed up the strawberries, uh, put it in, in um, some water with two packs of stevia, bring that to a simmering boil to reduction and then poured it into a ceramic bowl covered it with ceramic wrap and put it into the freezer tomorrow i shall have me a slushy yay try it it's awesome Mwah. laters